potential change in parallel circuit. Let's say the EMF is 3 volt. Okay, we can assume that this, this point is positive 3 volt and this point is 0 volt, eh? so that the potential difference is 3 volt. If you connect a volt meter from this point to this point, then it's, uh, the, the reading is 3 volt. Eh? Okay, from A to B, the potential remain the same, 3 volt, because there's no resistance. From B to C, the potential remain the same, because there's no resistance. This is a parallel circuit, so it's split, eh? the, the, the circuit split at this point. But from C to D, there's still no resistance. C to D, no resistance. Eh? C to D, no resistance. So if there's no resistance, no work done, therefore the potential remain the same, positive 3 volts. So does C to F. Okay, C to F, no resistance. So therefore, the potential remain the same. So from positive 3 volt, still positive 3 volt. Even though the resistance is not the same, eh? the potential is the same here. It's not like current. Current is split. Eh? It splits uh, here, it's a higher, here is lower. That's, that's current. This is potential. Potential will remain the same if there's no resistance between the two points. Eh? So that is for this part. Then how about this part? Here to here, the potential is the same. Why? Because there's no resistance. Okay, I to J. Yeah? Then how about H to I? Still zero. Because there's no resistance. Uh? E to H, still zero. Or G to H, still zero. Why? Because there's no resistance. So here, the potential zero. Here, the potential three volt. So if you put your volt meter here, B to I, V3, you will get three volt. If you put a volt meter here, D to E, you still get 3 volt, positive 3 to 0. If V2, still 3 volt, 3 to 0. Eh? If you connect C to H, still you will get 3 volt. Even though the resistance is not the same, eh? 2 ohm, 7 ohm. Eh? So now, can you see that? For parallel circuit, the potential difference is always the same for each branch. Here 3 wood, here 3 wood, here to here 3 wood, here to here 3 wood. You connect here to here also 3 wood. It's always 3 wood. Now if this is 3 wood, eh, so we can assume that this point is a positive 3 wood, right? Here is 0 wood, right? So how about the potential here? Positive 3, right? Because there's no resistance here, positive 3. Then how about here? 0, right? Okay, so what's the potential difference? 3. Answer is 3. If you put a word meter here. So, uh, I let your friend answer you, okay? So what's the readings of the word meter if you put a word meter here? 3 wood. That's correct. 3 wood. Why? Because here, here also, positive 3 wood. Here, 0 wood. So the reading is still 3 wood. This is a parallel circuit. As I told you just now, right, for parallel circuits, the readings of the wood meter is the same for this uh, all the resistor. Let me show you the notes. This one. If here 3 wood, here 3 wood, here must also be 3 wood. Here 3 wood, you put here also 3 wood, put here also 3 wood, you put here also 3 wood, you put here also 3 wood. 